back to the show. <laughs> Folks, my next guest is a comedian you know from her stand-up specials, One Mississippi, and Star Trek Discovery. Please welcome Tig Notaro. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hi. Haven't seen you in a few months. Yep, it's been about three or four. Something like that. Yep. Yeah. Ballpark. Mm -hmm. Ballpark. What's up? What's up? What's been going on? You know, just. Uh... I don't. Actually, <laughs> that's why I asked. I um, I, I've just been working. My um, my wife and I started a production company, and we've been writing things together. And yeah. what's the name of the company? <laughs> Uh, thanks for asking. It's uh, Something Fierce Productions. Oh, I like that. Yeah, thank wow. you. Um, <laughs> it's a hit. <laughs> uh, yeah, it is. We yeah. actually had a, um, a meeting with, um, and I don't, I don't like to name drop or anything, but with uh, Reese Witherspoon. And, um, oh, yeah. Very talented young woman. It, she's, she is very good. It's just this is part of my life. And so, um, anyway, so uh, Stephanie and I... Just hanging with Reese is part of your life. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, I can't claim that she's one of my closest friends, but, you know, we're, we're friendly. Uh, <laughs> but don't make a big deal about it. Um, yep. So Stephanie, my wife, and I went to meet with uh, Reese and her producing partner. And um, Reese was talking about, in the meeting, how she's one of the shortest people on the cast of um, Big Little Lies. Right, right. Yeah, she said she's five foot one. Yeah. And just what I should have mentioned earlier is I realized in this meeting that I, I have a hearing problem. And uh, this in is... In the middle of the meeting, it occurred to you. Well, a after the meeting, when I got some more information, um, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what happened. Um, so Reese said, you know, I'm five foot one. She said Laura Dern is five foot ten. Nicole Kidman is five eleven, and Shailene's five eight. Mm -hmm. And then I interjected, "Oh my gosh, that's so interesting!" Because years ago I dated a woman that was six feet tall, and I think she was kind of insecure about her height, so she hunched. Now, your response is very similar to Reese's response <laughs> and her producing partner and my wife. And I was just sitting there going, yeah, so. And uh, I thought I was, it seems like I said something that contributed to the conversation. <laughs> So they were like, oh, yeah, well, she was talking about height, sure. Um, but it was conversation adjacent. Sure. And, um, and then we wrapped up the meeting, and, and it was like, okay, bye-bye. And uh, we walked out, and then Stephanie said, um, what <laughs> in the hell were you talking about in there? And that's when I realized that I didn't know that there was an actress named Shailene. And so what I heard was that Nicole Kidman was 5'11", and she leans 5'8". <laughs> so... That's when I jumped in with, oh my gosh, that's so crazy. I dated a woman that hunched. <laughs> Bye. Well, you, have a, you have a new television show called Under a Rock with Tig Notaro. I wouldn't use the word television. You have a new show. Yeah. A new show yep. that is on, is shot on video. Uh, it's online. It's online. Yeah. It's an online show. You can get it funny or die. Mm hmm. And, and you it's can called... see it on Amazon, too, I think. Okay. Yeah. 
I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. <laughs> uh, I it, it, explain what it is. What is what is under a rock with Tig Notaro? Under a Rock is, uh, it was a show created because I have a hard time recognizing famous people. Mm -hmm. And so... Because you're not like, you're not plugged into popular culture? I don't follow pop culture. I follow music and I follow documentaries, yeah. but I really kind of miss everything else. And why I didn't, maybe didn't know about Shailene. Sure. Um, <laughs> but um, anyway, so I have people on my talk show uh, and it's... Uh, me interviewing them, trying to figure out who they are. We have, we have a... <laughs> Why would any celebrity come on your show, by the way? I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. We have a clip here, and it's you with, uh, do you know who this James is? James Vanderbeek. James Vanderbeek. Yep. James Vanderbeek, Dawson of Dawson's Creek. And, and you, when he came in for the interview, had no damn idea who he was, right? No clue. Jim? All right, here's the first clue. A stream. Or a? River. Less, less rapid than a river. A creek. All right. <laughs> this is amazing. I want to hold on to this because okay, you hold this on. is funny to me. <laughs> okay. That is fantastic. I love that. Thank you. Now we're going to do this. We're going to do this, okay? Okay. We're going to do this. I'm going to show you some photographs of some pop culture figures. Okay. And nobody tell her what they are, okay? Because if she doesn't get them, I'm not telling her, okay? I want you rather maintain your ignorance, wouldn't you? Absolutely. Okay. So and I will maybe show... they'd be a guest on my show. Maybe, okay. Yeah. I will show you a photograph and uh, you tell me if you know who they are. So how do I... You, you have to lean forward maybe a little bit because so the camera has to see this too, okay? Ready? Who's this? The Rock. Oh, okay. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Who's this? Don't know. Don't How know. You don't know who this is? Maybe gonna be the next Bond? Nope. I don't know. I don't know who that is. You don't know who this is? Uh, supermodel? Project Runway host? Oh. Um... Nope. No? Nope. These are all very good performers, by the way. <laughs> Any of these people. I know him. Which one? Which one? Him? Chris. Who's... Yes. I've met him. Okay. <laughs> and he's from The Office. Right. What did it say? Who? This he's guy? from The Office, right? Yeah. What's his name? Um, Chris Pratt. Right. And, and, he's, and who's this? What's his name? <laughs> um, Here's a hint. Chris. You know, his name is Chris. Chris. His name's Chris. What do you imagine the other two names are? <laughs> Chris Evans? Yes! Okay. And Chris and Chris. And lastly, who's this? Uh... He loves Quaker Oats. <laughs> he was in I Cocoon. Don't know his, I don't know his name, but I... You don't know his name? No. He's got the diabetes. <laughs> no, no Tig. You don't know his name there, Tig. I prefer to call it Livabetus. I can't wait to see your show. <laughs> Tig, nice to see you again. Nice to see you. Under a rock with Tig Guitar.